Hi everyone. So this is from the website Paste and it's the 30 greatest Beatles songs according to them. And I have not looked at the list yet and I'm kind of scared to, <laughs> but uh, be interested, you know, every list for any Beatles list with, you know, for songs, they're, they're going to be all over the place. But be interesting to see what number one is for this. It should be a day in the life. Here we go. Number 30, Penny Lane. That's a pretty good choice. I like, I love the, the song. That's an interesting choice. You're going to lose that girl. I think that's a very underrated song. Hmm. I like it, you know, when some of the lists surprise you in a good way. <laughs> All you need is love at number 28. I wouldn't say it's ever been one of my favorite Beatles songs, but still I love the song. It's just the Beatles have so many great songs. Number 27, very in, I, I'm liking this list for no one. Once again, you know, not one of the Beatles most known songs. It's not like played on the radio or anything, but nice to see it in this list. Yeah. One of Paul McCartney's great songs. Number 26, I will Julia. The final two tracks on side two. I, I don't think you're allowed to put two songs together. It breaks the rules. <laughs> but yeah, both are very nice songs. I, I don't, they would not be on my top 30, but this isn't my top 30. Yeah, Ticket to Ride. That's a very good choice. Across the Universe. Yep. Yeah. Eleanor Rigby, yeah. You know, I was I was just thinking for anyone that loves the Beatles, there might, there's probably a Beatles fan that dislikes, you know, like I want to hold your hand or Strawberry Fields Forever or kind of weird to think about it, but I'm sure they're out there. So Eleanor Rigby at number 23. It's all too much. Nice to see that on the list. I love that song from the Yellow Submarine soundtrack. Happiness is a Warm Gun, very underrated song from the White Album. Interesting choices. Revolution, great choice. Paperback writer, yeah. Now, Tomorrow Never Knows, that would be, what is it? Yeah, for me, like for years and years and years, it's been number one, A Day in the Life, number two, Tomorrow Never Knows, number three, Strawberry Fields Forever. But I love some Paul songs too, of course. She's leaving home. Wouldn't be, you know, like I said, once again, I love the song, but it wouldn't be in my top 30. But it's in this one. Two of Us. A nice choice. Although, like for Let, Let It Be, Across the Universe, I would have, I hope it's on the list. But it's nice to see Two of Us on it. While My Guitar Gently Weeps didn't even make the top 10. Great song. And Your Bird Can Sing. For the top 30, uh, I wouldn't include it, but... I didn't real. Yeah, it's a pretty short song. Two minutes and one second. And I Love Her, that's a nice choice. Yesterday, a classic. Now, 
yesterday would be in my top 30. I know, you know, some people say, oh, it's overplayed or whatever, but it doesn't take away a song being overplayed on the radio. You can't blame the song that it's <laughs> overplayed on the radio. It's still a great song. Blackbird, another nice choice. Oh, Strawberry Fields Forever made the top 10. I'm happy. Hey Jude. Yep. I want to hold your hand. Yeah, that should be in the top 10. Here, There and Everywhere. One of John Lennon's favorite Paul McCartney songs. Let It Be. Yeah, that would be in my top 10 probably. In my life. Yeah, so overall, some pretty good picks. If this was Rolling Stone, it'd be a different uh, <laughs> scenario. Norwegian Wood, this bird has flown. So here's the top three. Is it going to be shocking? Something. Yeah, something wouldn't be in my top 30, but still, obviously a great song. Yeah, oh, I'm happy. A Day in the Life, it's number two. So what is number one? Apologies, I just want to go back. Tomorrow Never Knows was on this, right? Yeah. Okay. I have no idea. Number one is... Oh, that's, that's not fair. That is cheating. I don't like that. Th this list sucks now. <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I don't know. You can't just pull a bunch of songs together and say, number one is the Abbey Road medley. But it is like, I love all of the songs, especially Golden Slumbers, Me, Mr. Mustard, You Never Give Me Your Money. But uh, yeah. Just kind of silly to have that as the number one. Like to have the Abbey Road medley chosen as one of the songs. Well, besides that, a good list. <laughs> so I would love your thoughts. And what would be, what would be your top three Beatles songs? Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.